Good morning. We're here at the uh, Miami Boat Show. We're really excited. Bayliner and Trophy's launching a whole new series of boats. Uh, we're bringing five new boats over from uh, Europe, and uh, these are gonna be the new Trophy lines. We're gonna offer two 23 foot, one pilot house, one explorer weekend or cabin style boat, two 25s, one of each model. And then the boat I'm currently standing on is the flagship, which is the 29 Explorer. And we'll talk a little bit more about that boat now. So this boat does come standard with twin engines. We're bringing it to North America with twin 225s. This boat does come standard with the extended top. Uh, it does have the full canvas, which comes with the uh, North American package as well. You do see in the floor, we do sea deck the entire cockpit area down into the helm area. One nice thing about this boat is it does come in the northern markets with heat and for the southern markets, it does come with air conditioning. A couple of the key points in this boat that we like to point out is the, uh, the massive headroom inside the boat. One of the key features on this boat is in this style, when you walk in, typically you feel very confined. As you can see, there's a ton of room with the head. As I'm pointing to the head here, you do see it's got a nice sunroof as well uh, which this does open up so in the cooler days or days you want to get fresh air in you can get it throughout the cockpit this table does fold down so you can utilize this as an additional bed a couple of the key features you'll see here I can open up it does come with a fresh hot water system so you do have a sink you'll notice down below it does have refrigerator and then there is an optional stove on this boat as well diesel a couple of the other key features I like to point out on this boat as I mentioned this boat is equipped with heat and air conditioning so if you take a look on this side over here it does come with the Mabru uh, air conditioning that is a uh, 12 volt system boat does come standard with shore power and then it does have a large battery bank so you can utilize that air conditioner even when you're not plugged in at the dock a couple of the other key features you notice is how large this windshield is so these boats are primarily in the coastal markets Great Lakes area um, you'll find them in the Pacific Northwest the Northeast so a lot of inside boating which is nice but you still feel very open from the amount of uh, clear visibility throughout the whole area here. One nice thing also you'll notice is the captain's side entry and exit door. So if you do have to get out, you'll notice there's walkways on this side to get up to the bow. We'll talk about a little bit about the bow here in a minute, but up front you do see it does come with a full pad, uh, which is on the North American package as well. So once you're anchored up, and trying to enjoy that nice weather, you and your guests can get out on the bow area and utilize that space as well. As we step down in, um, you will notice with the twin engines, it does give you the flip up bolster seat, but uh, with the twin engine options, it does come with the DTS system, digital throttle control, the boat we are bringing over with the full Simrad system, uh, which is tied in with GPS. Uh, so all the bells and whistles you're gonna need for that boat. A Couple of the key features up top that we are doing too, standard on the North American package, does come with a VHF radio, and then there's a spotlight up above here as well. So trying to give you all the things you'll need for a weekend away. And then as you can see, we can step down into this area here. A Couple of the points uh, that I'll point out here, does come with a full head area. Uh, which does have a shower down inside there as well. So again, you can utilize the weekend without having going to back to the marina. It does have a mid berth section, uh, which down in this area here, you can see down back and below. And then we can step into the master quarters here, which again, gives you plenty of uh, headroom here. You'll see it does have glass on both sides. You do have an exit here as well. And then up top, so you still get a very open feeling in here does come with a nice storage area for closet and storage when you're away for those weekends. A couple of the optional features, it does come with a flat screen TV if you do want to mount that there. So on a rainy day, if you want to watch a movie, it makes it nice. Step up into the bed, steps molded into the hull design on both sides. So if you do have children that want to sleep up here, it is easy for them to get up in here as well. As you can see here, as I mentioned earlier, it does have the windshield system, the large windshield with the windshield wipers. These bow cushions are removable. But again, it gives you a lot of nice access up here. And then you do have the windless anchor controls uh, from inside and out. Uh, so it makes, gives you a nice big walkway all the way around the cockpit area. So if you do need to get off and drop your boat bumpers or your anchor, you do have plenty of room. So wrapping up, we would think uh, this boat would be perfect for the weekend boater. Um, we're trying to bring more price conscious value models back to North America. This boat fully equipped, you can get in and still be in a nice mid-level range on price and uh, I would say it's gonna be a great boat for the weekend getaway, get out of the weather. If it does get warm out, like I mentioned, you do have air conditioning, 
and uh, it should be a great boat for any market.